Hey everybody, August is here, almost. And when everyone is here for Stop Advance, I'm gonna be sending you guys home with August's curriculum. So I wanted to walk through the supplies. Quick thing, I have all of the lessons and parent cues bunched together. So as I go through each week, the parent cue or the lesson won't be in that pile. So just imagine with me. For, starting with first look, week one, you'll be getting your lessons. The Bible activity page, later there's another page that looks like this, but it's not colored and it doesn't have words at the bottom. So make sure you recognize that this is the one that is for week one. You have the heart activity page. Just a second, sorry guys. Heart activity page. And then the clock activity page. The clock, there's one per kiddo. And then you'll be getting heart stickers and your memory verse as well as your parent cues. That week, you just need to gather masking tape for one of the activities. Week two, you'd be getting lessons, parent cues, the building activity page, which each one is different and it's a set per small group, as well as the love activity page, which says the Bible is better than gold. You'll also be getting popsicle sticks for that, which are the smaller popsicle sticks. And that week you will need to gather construction paper and make a heart out of tape on the floor. Week three, you'll be receiving lessons. The house activity page, which is this one. It says the Bible is better than gold. Gray tissue paper. And then your parent cues, obviously. That week you're gonna need to gather blocks. If you don't have some readily available in your rooms, make sure to gather some and have them in that space for your small group leaders. And then a few pieces of brown and gray construction paper. Week four, you're getting lesson. The barn activity page, which is this one. Yellow pom-poms, which are in that bag the masterpiece activity page, which is this one. It looks like the other Bible one, but this one isn't colored, has the words at the bottom. And there's one per kid on this. Sheets of stickers, which are these. There's one sheet per kid. And then a small plastic jar. You're gonna also need to gather one normal sized mason jar for that week. So this activity, you're putting a barn on the front of this jar in the mason jar. And it's talking about storing up our treasures um, and so you'll fill this with your golden coins and it'll overflow and go into the next jar. And I made sure that the amount that would go into this one is more than what you guys got. So then moving on to 252, you'll be getting your lesson. Hey, Jane and John, you'll be getting, <laughs> just taking a video for <laughs> um, your Space Bop stories. And then paper plates, which are in this bag, large craft sticks, which are in this bag, as well as balloons. And then you'll need to gather starbursts. Week two, lessons, parent cues, the suit up activity page, which is this one. And then you're gonna be getting a paper grocery bag, like the larger ones, there's one per kid. And Plastic forks will be in there as well. One thing to note, on your guys' sheets, I printed these out and then I realized that there was some stuff from an activity that would took off. So if I don't get time to scratch it out on all of them, just know that the last two things on this list, you weren't sent, it's not an activity that we're doing, it's not in the lesson. So that week you do have quite a bit of prep that you'll need to do, so be thinking ahead, gather some people to help you with that. So you're gonna need a pepper shaker, bars of soap, bowls for water and paper towels. Prep, I would cut the bars of soap in half just to make them go further so you have less that you need to buy. And then you'll need to cut a panel out of the front of the grocery bags because those grocery bags, they're turning them into astronaut helmets. Um, week three, you're getting lessons, parent cues, and then these rock, rocket booster cards activity page which they're printed on green paper. That week you'll need to gather construction paper and masking tape and make a rocket ship outline on the ground with tape. Week four, you'll be getting lessons, parent cues, rocket ship template. You'll need to 
cut one of these out per kid. And then the bingo cards, which are these ones, and your bingo tiles, which are these. A 60 piece puzzle, which is this. And for that week for prep, you will need something for the kids to mark their bingo cards with, so like beads, uh, cut up pieces of construction paper, Skittles, whatever you guys want. Um, blue or black poster board, you're gonna need one per worship experience per small group, silver or white marker to write on that board, a bandana, and then you'll need to cut out your bingo tiles and place them in a cover bowl. Oh, I forgot to put on this list. You'll also need to cut out the rocket ships one per kit. If that doesn't get done, that's okay because they can totally cut those out on their own in the worship experience. Just make sure that there's time given to them to cut those out. So that is everything we're sending you for shopping. As always, if you're low on construction paper, get that for week for 252 week one, you're gonna need starbursts. Week two, a pepper shape shaker if you can't bring one from home. A few bars of cheap soap. Read the lesson to determine how many you think you'll need. Like I said, pro tip, cut them in half. And then lastly, blue or black poster board. One per worship experience per small group. Um, lastly, I wanted to just let you guys know we are in a new prep space. Ignore how crazy messy it is right now. It's all, all of our supplies and then also some staff advanced supplies. But in the craziness of transitioning over to this building and i've also have a team who's helping more with prep and they're taking on more there might be some times that you're missing a sheet or you're missing an item always feel free to message me and i can help you come up with adaptations or i can help you out if you can't find something but just wanting to let you guys know that there might be just a few more mix-ups as we are transitioning into this space with this new team, who I am so grateful for, this team. They're amazing. So if you ever think of them, say a prayer for them and their sanity. Um, thank you guys, and hope this all makes sense.